孙哥和阿提提亚教授呢进行最后的大会总结。Now we move into the final session of、uh, conclusion. We would like to invite Professor Nigam and Professor Sunke to come forward、uh, to offer a few conclu concluding remarks. Um, I think you all are tired, so I will. 尽量快的，呃，简洁的传达我想，呃，表述的一些看法。I think everyone is pretty tired, so I'll try to be brief and concise. 呃，这次到呃呃克拉拉来，呃，我个人的感觉是既亲切又陌生。亲切的原因是因为，呃，我们。都是南方国家，我们都曾有过呃被殖民和半殖民的呃惨痛的经验。同时，我们今天又共同面对着呃在知识上去殖民这样一个很呃深刻的问题。但是，觉得陌生是因为印度的历史有它的。丰富性和多样性，而且有它自身的逻辑，而这一切对于我们来说是不能够用我们在中国社会生活的经验直接去套用和解释的，当然更不能够使用后殖民的理论去理解。Um, I'm very happy to appear in in the in the, in Kerala.、Um, I, we feel both、uh, intimately connected to this place, but also、uh, unfamiliar about this place、uh, for various reasons. We feel、uh, intimately connected to it because India,、uh, uh, like China, were、uh, semi-colonial or colonized spaces, and we also share the same challenge to、um, intellectually decolonize ourselves. At the same time, we also feel, feel quite、uh, alienated or unfamiliar with this place because of the diversity and richness of Indian culture, as well as its own inner logic、um, of social、um, social process, which cannot be adequately、uh, understood、uh, by us from the outside. Of course, no, can it be understood adequately、uh, or explained adequately by postcolonial theory? 呃，我们这些带来自中国大陆和台湾的学者，非常感谢在座的各位印度学者。呃，你们虽然使用英语，呃，向我们呃敞开了印度社会的大门，但是你们表述的却是本土的在地经验。这样，我们感觉到我们已经开始接近印度社会非常丰富的。呃，非常诱人的这样的一个丰富的宝藏。Um, we want to thank especially Indian scholars for、uh, introducing your own culture and local experiences to us in English,、um, because by doing so,、um, we are able to、uh, to get in touch with the richness and diversity of the Indian society. 我一直有一个想法。一个学术讨论会成功的标志，就是带走的问题比带来的问题更多。在这个意义上，我认为这一次的学术讨论会是成功的，因为我们回去的时候会带走更多的疑问，而不是答案。I tend to have to think that to value the success of a conference. Uh, depends on how many questions you have generated in the end of it, rather than what you, the questions you brought to it.、Uh, in this sense, in this regard, I think this conference is quite a success because by the time we're leaving, I think we already have a lot more questions than we have come with. Uh, I listened to the presentation of these two days, and I had many questions. So, please allow me to speak in the shortest time possible. 已经很多的问题上再增加一些问题，希望我们能够呃在以后的交流当中进一步的推进它。Um, below, I want to offer a few questions that I have. I know there's been a lot of questions on the table, but I just want to add this a couple more、uh, to 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 us. 
so that we can advance these questions um, in, in the future communications. 首先我想谈一个我个人的感想,就是去殖民的知识和后殖民的知识,他们之间到底有什么样的差异? First I want to begin by reflecting on this question, what is the differences between postcolonial uh, knowledge and decolonizing knowledge? Uh, 我认为至少有三个方面, 呃, 能使我们的, 呃, 讨论, the first thing is I think there are three aspects uh, that can differentiate our intellectual uh, production here from uh, the, post the postcolonial scholarship. The first one is the, um, the, the aspect of um, betrayal, because much of the postcolonial theory or discussion uh, is based upon um, an understanding of colonialism, despite its critical nature. Uh, it does not oversee the parameters of colonialism. But,去殖民的知识,在认识论上是以重建自我为前提的,因此它并不受制于殖民主义的知识生产,也不受制于后殖民知识的批判方式。in contrast, decolonizing knowledge has an aim at reconstruction of the self. In this sense, it is not restrained by uh, either the, coast, the colonial uh, mentality or, or frame of knowledge, nor the post-colonial frame of knowledge. The是去殖民的知识生产和后殖民的知识生产都以反对本质主义作为自己的认识论。但是,呃,去殖民的知识,它更勇敢地强调反本质主义的特殊性,而后殖民知识是不能够理直气壮地去强调特殊性的。Both postcolonial knowledge formations and decolonizing knowledge, knowledge formations are against essential, essentialism, but one difference between them is that uh, Decolonizing uh, knowledge formations wanted to emphasize the specific specificities of its um, anti-essentialism, whereas postcolonial uh, theory or knowledge formations uh, would not be able to do so. Uh,第三个特点是,呃,后殖民的知识在认识论上最终将导致对同一性的追求,而去殖民的知识生产 uh, 由于他追求多样化的非实体性的非本质主义的特殊性,因此他最终的目标是建立各种特殊性之间的关联,这也是我们这次会议的一个基调。um, another difference, difference between postcolonial and decolonizing knowledge formations is this. The former, the postcolonial formation, tends to uh, uh, pursue uh, sameness or similarity, whereas decolonized informations wanted to emphasize plurality, the non-substantive um, being of singularities, and particularly to emphasize the relationship between different singularities. Uh, 我们希望获得的去殖民知识生产的认识论自觉的问题。当然，这还只是我最初步的想法。我很希望能和在座的各位在今后进一步推进，呃，在理论上的对这个问题的思考。what I said just now uh, has a lot to do with the sort of epistemological self-awareness of decolonizing uh, knowledge formations. Um, we, have, we, ha we still have a lot of grounds to cover, especially uh, in theoretical terms, about how this uh, particular intellectual trajectory is going to lead to. Uh, 
，对于我们来说，它究竟具有什么意义？呃，这次会议上，无论是呃使用什么语言的学者，我们都面对的是我们各自的历史。那么，呃。这次会议得出的一个初步的成果，就在于，呃，我们通过翻译这样一种形式，重新定位了进入历史这样一种过程的性质。用梁志平教授的表述来说，那就是当我们进入我们自己历史的时候，实实际上我们进入的是一个翻译的过程。Um, another point I want to mention here is that I think this conference has uh, has uh, crystallized the, the the question of history to us, particularly um, how we enter our own history, given the fact that we are using different languages. Um, I think the initial product of this conference is that we, as we are, uh, is that we now uh, realize fairly vividly. Uh, when we are entering the discussion of history, especially the specific histories that we uh, we share or do not share, we are already entering the phase of translation. I think this is a very important theoretical question. We need to further investigate. Entering history is to enter the phase of translation. 演变，我们不能轻易的断言。我们今天的生活经验和我们今天使用的概念，可以直接的去解释那一段历史，哪怕它属于我们。Um, I think there is also a theoretical proposition that I would like to offer by saying that uh, uh, encountering or facing our history is a process of translation. What I mean by that is, I think if we understand to encounter history means a process of translation, it means that this history has already become an other to ourselves. We cannot assume that we, we, given the fact that we are using the same language and、uh, living in the same history, that we are capable of adequately explaining what happened in the past. 在这种情况下，我们最需要警惕的就是以当下为中心的。呃，话语霸权，因为历史已经不能够直接对我们进行回应。呃，因此呢，我们可以很轻易的去重新呃建构历史，甚至宰割历史，而这就意味着我们没有进入那个翻译过程。Um, this also means we need to be especially cautious in thinking about history. Uh, because one thing that we need to, to be especially careful for about、uh, thinking of history is that there is a sense of hegemony of the presentism. The presentist hegemony, doc,、uh, in certain sense, dominated what history means to us. So unless we have certain sense of awareness of the translation process in encountering history, then we are very likely to sl slide into、uh, this hegemony of the presentism. 以完全同样的逻辑，我们也可以进入他人同时代的他人的呃社会现实。比如说，我们这次来尝试着进入同时代印度的语境，在这里我们遭遇到了各种陌生的问题。By the same logic,、uh, we can also understand entering the other social reality or the realities of the other people is also a process of translation. Uh, we encountered, for example, the d 遇到了阿迪提亚，呃，讲到的，呃，当我们面对资本主义论述的时候，实际上我们要关注的是在地的和物质性的这样的一种，呃，有限度的现实，并且准确的解释他们。呃，比如说，呃，像，呃，尼维卡讲到的弗洛伊德的精神分析。如何在印度被转化为另外一种解释的这样的一个过程？呃，还比如说，呃，阿萨里
呃讲到的伊斯兰和民族主义的复杂关系，所有这些论述对于我们来说都是不能轻易简化的很重要的特殊性经验。我们会用我们的方式尽可能的谨慎的去理解和进入它。Um, for instance, in this conference, we have encountered uh, quite a few different discussions. For instance, Devika's uh, discussion of the uh, need for uh, developing new mode of uh, explanation to understand the uh, conditions in Kalada, uh, or Aditya's discussion of the importance of the local configurations of materiality for understanding um, the possibility or impossibility of a non-capitalist non mode of being or uh, Nivitata's discussion of the, uh, 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 of the translation or transformation of fraud, Freudian psychoanalysis in, uh, in India, or uh, this other discussion about the connection between Islam and nationalism. All of these instances tells us that we cannot simplify any of these complex his singularities, and we will try not to do so um, in our approach to, to them. 我相信，对于在座的各位印度同行来说，我们这些呃中国人也带来了一些陌生的问题。呃，那么现在呢，我想利用下面呃剩下的一点时间呢，对于我们带来里的问题里的一部分进行一些呃具体的呃说明。Um, so I think this would be the same for Indian scholars when they hear our presentations. They might find a lot of questions that we uh, propose here are fairly alienating or alien. Um, so what I'm going to do in the following time is to sort of open up some of the, or uh, unpack some of the questions that we have brought together, brought, brought over. Uh,这两天里边被讨论的比较多的问题呢,我认为有两个,一个呢是关于民族主义的问题。另一个呢是关于现代国家想象的问题。我想先就第一个问题做一点补充，就是怎么去理解中国的民族主义。I think there are two major questions that have been、uh, addressed in the last two days. One of them is nationalism. The other is the imagination of modern nation state.、Uh, and I want to begin by、uh, attacking on the first question. 呃、uh, ，在中国的官方表述里，呃、uh, ，中国有五十六个民族，呃、uh, ，而且呢，汉族占百分之九十，呃，所以呢，如果在概念层面上，我们会认为这是一个由汉民族主导的国家，但是中国的历史不是这样的。Um, as we heard from the presentations today,、uh, there are six, 56 nationalities in China. This is the official number. And the Han uh, population uh, occupies about 90% of all, all people in China.、Uh, so conceptually speaking, it might sound like it might sound like that the Han、uh, population dominated China. But historically speaking, it is not quite the case. 呃，实际上，中国的这五十多个民族是可以分成两大类的，一类是农耕民族，一类是游牧民族。呃、uh, ，in a certain sense, the 56 nationalities can be recategorized into two different major categories. One is the nomadic tribes or the nomadic population. The other is the agricultural population. 呃，汉民族占了农耕民族里的呃绝大部分，所以呢，它往往被视为农耕民族的主体。但是中国历史其实是由农耕民族和呃游牧民族轮流执政的历史。嗯 ，because the 呃、uh, ，because of the Han pop，because the fact that Han population。Is primarily an ag agricultural population, so it may seem that the Han population is more dominant. But in the history of China,、um, uh, the the nomadic、uh, population and the agricultural population、uh, take turns to be the dominant to be the dominant group、uh, in Chinese history. Uh, yesterday, there were several reports that mentioned that in the Han Dynasty, the Han Communist Party was the dominant group. 革命论述，那么它的对象呢是推翻呃满清王朝
，实际上那个时候的排满。和今天汉族中心的这个社会，汉族主导的这个社会，对于少数民族的相对优势，呃，在结构上恰好是相反的。Um, two presentations yesterday talked about the uh, Han-centered uh, nationalism uh, in uh, Han-centered Han-center nationalist revolutionary discourses, uh, particularly this idea of the anti-Manchu uh, uh, revolution. Um, but the conditions of Man, uh, the conditions of the minorities then, and the, uh, that is the Manchu, and the conditions of minorities today, uh, is very different. China's last traditional monarchy was a Manchu-controlled Qing monarchy. The Qing monarchy was about 300 years ago, and from the Qing Dynasty to the present day. 汉人建立政权的时间，呃，还呃才刚刚呃超过一百年，而且如果从一九四九年中国呃建立第一个独立的主权国家算起，呃，这个汉族为主的政权还没有持续到一百年的时间。嗯 ，The Qing Dynasty, which was run by the Manchus, uh. Was in uh, was in place for about 300 years. Um, in comparison, the Xinhai Revolution that uh, led to the, uh, uh, the 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 nation state by the Han population uh, is uh, that was created in 1912 is uh, is has just me, me, um, has just merely passed 100 years. But if we want to be more specific, the first um, um, sovereign nation state is that. Uh, in China, established by um, by the Communist Revolution in uh, in 1949, is is even less than a hundred years. 除了清朝之外，呃呃，中国历史上还有由蒙古族统治的元朝。再往前，唐朝的呃血统也并不完全是汉人的血统，而再往前推。由呃鲜卑族呃等游牧民族统治的时期，也是中国历史上一个呃占重要呃位置的阶段。Um, so besides the Qing Dynasty in Chinese history, there is also the Yuan Dynasty that was ruled by the Mongolians, and even the dynasty before the Yuan, uh, the two dynasty before the Yuan, which is the Tang Dynasty. Uh, the rulers were not entirely Han population. It was quite a mix of the nomadic and agricultural uh, population. So um, the nomadic population has actually played a very significant role in shaping Chinese history. So, 历史就是他们主体性建构的历史。呃，举个例子，我曾经在呃内蒙古的首府呼和浩特呃参观了呃呼和浩特的这个自治区的历史博物馆。我在那儿看到的《中国通史》，完全是以游牧民族为主的呃历史。Um, so in this sense, the nomadic uh, population is never outside of Chinese society. In, a, in contrast, the, uh, on a very, uh, uh, um, uh, uh, I'm sorry, um, in, uh, in, in fact, they're actually within the Chinese society as a, as a part of its constitu uh, constituent. Um, one example I can offer you is that I had this chance to visit a, a museum in Urum, uh, Urumqi, uh, or Huhe Hao Te in, in contemporary Chinese terms, um, in, in, the uh, in, the, in the northern part of China, where uh, the Chinese history was nar narrated through a nomadic perspective. In the Yomu民 building the Yomu民, they have not only expanded the geography of China, but they have the ability to expand the Yomu民 and the Yomu民 and the Yomu民 and the Yomu民. 比如说，呃，在清朝的时候，满族不但呃呃，满族政权不但重新这个编纂了中国的
从呃《史记》开始的这个二十四史，而且他们吸纳汉人进入了呃满满族的政权。呃，那么在呃唐代呢？呃，具有胡人血统的这样的一个呃融合性的政权呢，他们创立了这个呃科举制度的一个完整的形态。而科举制度在呃后来的无论是汉族还是呃游牧民族的王朝里边，都一直以不同的形态得到了延续。Um, so in this very specific sense, the nomadic population who ru that ruled China has actually increased the uh, interactions and the commingling of the nomadic and the agricultural populations. For instance, the Qin Dynasty even recompiled the history of China and turned uh, and, and turned them into what we call the 24 histories. Um, they also incorporated or recruited the Han population into uh, into the government. The Tang Dynasty that created the uh, civil s service examination system uh, wa was, um, was used um, throughout history until the early 20th century, uh, no matter who actually ran the government. Of 呃，我现在想谈的是，呃，我们不能仅仅把呃民族关系理解为汉族和呃游牧民族之间的对立。如果这样的话，我们会简化中国丰富多样的历史和现实。Um, so in this sense, we cannot argue that、uh, China is a Han-centered、uh, country. No, do we? No, can we say it is not? I think I, what, what I want to imply here is that we need to suspend such a judgment and uh, try not to uh, understand the, um, the, 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 the social relations in China as simply a binary between the Han versus the minorities. In fact, that's really going to simplify our understanding of what China is. 呃，还有一个不得不呃谈的问题就是，中国的汉族其实是一个非常多样化的民族，它不是均质性的。比如说，我和呃在这儿坐的两位来自广东的同样汉族的学者，呃，我们在交流的时候，如果不使用普通话的话，我们是没有办法呃相互沟通的。他们讲起广东话来，呃，对我来说，那是比英语还要困难的一门语言。Uh, another point that we need to know is that the Han population in China is actually fairly diverse. It is not a homogeneous group. For instance,、um, we have two colleagues from China here, from the、uh, from the southern、uh, from southern China, the Guangdong province. They uh, speak uh, the the Cantonese uh, language. So if we do not communicate in um, in the Putonghua in the man, in Mandarin, then it will be very difficult for me、uh, to understand them,、uh, because Cantonese sounds to me、uh, more difficult than English. Uh, 而且今天构成呃中国社会最基本矛盾的那样的一些尖锐的问题，大部分发生在汉族社会内部。而不仅仅是汉族有与游牧民族之间的紧张关系。Moreover, the kind of social conflicts that we see in China today are mostly constituted within the Han population, and much less so between the Han and the minorities. 当然，我还要呃简单的批判一下汉族中心主义的问题。我觉得至少有两个方面是我们作为汉族人必须加以自省的问题。第一个方面就是在现实当中，今天的中国国家政权是以汉族为主的国家政权。呃，汉族呢，主要居住在现代化城市比较高的，呃呃，现代化程度比较高的大城市。呃，消耗了中国的大部分资源
呃，而且呢，汉族是推行消费主义和呃发展主义的最主要的力量，这是第一点。第二点呢是。呃，中国的汉族在一九四九年之后呢，他们开始大量开发游牧民族地区的自然资源，而且呢，这一种开发构成了对游牧民族的呃原来的生活状态的一种干扰，甚至是破坏。Um, however, I think we still need to criticize the Han-centered uh, ism. Uh, Today, um, and I want to point to two, two aspects that are worthy of our consideration. First of all, the, in reality, the Chinese po power are in the hands of the Han population, and these populations tend to occupy the modernized urban spaces, and they have used up used up a lot of resources and advocated for um, consumerism and developmentalism. Secondly, after 1949, a lot of the uh, national uh, a lot of the Han population. Um, moved to the nomadic uh, territories and um, and appropriated or exploited their resources, which uh, uh, brought about um, or even destroyed, uh, uh, which threatened and even destroyed uh, the li livelihood of the nomadic uh, minorities. 由于上述这种种呃特性，使得中国的民族主义真正具有呃非实体性。和流动性，呃，因此呢，可以说这是一种双向的政治动能。呃，向外，它对于国际上的呃各种这个压迫势力、呃，它表现为所谓的中华民族的民族主义，但是它并没有一个实体性的民族来支撑。向内呢，它可能表现为。呃，游牧民族和呃汉民族、农耕民族之间的某些紧张关系，但是它是不确定的和局部性的。嗯、um, ，So in this sense, the Chinese nationalism is very specifically non-substantive, and it is very fluid in many ways.、Uh, it has a, a, a bilateral uh, uh, political uh, uh, energy. That uh, constituted um, externally as a form of Chinese nationalism uh, against, you know, foreign in, uh, invasion, but also internally as this kind of conflict between the nomadic and the agricultural populations. Uh, uh, however, this conflict is merely regional and also uh, 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 temporary. 呃，我想这也是为什么在中国呃很难出现像印度这样的持续性的对于民族主义的呃反思和警惕这种思潮的最基本的原因。And I think this is also why in China it is very difficult to have a consistent reflection on nationalism as it as it did in、uh, in India. 呃，第二个问题，因为时间关系呢，我来不及完整的去表述，就是关于现代国家呃，或者说现代中国的想象的问题。我只想补充一点，呃，就是呃，在中国想呃被想象的时候，其实还有一些呃，从国民国家这样一个框架里边呃。溢到外面，剩到外面的剩余部分，这个就是中中国传统社会的天下观。Um, I do not have enough time to really go into、uh, to fully unpack the second point I want to make, which is the point about the、uh, imagination of modern nation state in China. However, I do want to point to 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 this particular、uh, argument, that is,、uh, in its imagine in its imagined form.、Uh, Of modern nation state in China, there is still a lot of surpluses that cannot be included, and this surplus points to this particular ideology or cosmology of the Tianxia system,、uh, which means everything is、uh, centered around、uh, the Middle Kingdom. From the Wang Chao's view, the country has a lot of surpluses, but the Tianxia is 
没有边界的。因此呢，天下是一个可以无限扩展的呃文明和礼仪的空间。但是从百姓的角度看，天下并不是个空间的概念，它是一种社会生活的伦理，是使得生活人得以连接的纽带。因此，对于中国老百姓来说，尽管这几天我们一直在讨论国家和社会的同构问题，但是对普通的生活人来说，天下是大于国家的。Um, for any dynasties, there is a territory, there is a boundary. However, for 天下 this particular ideology, there is no territory.、Um, It can be understood or conceived as a particular space,、um, but from the perspective of the ordinary people,、uh, the idea of the tianxia is boundless. It does not. It is not a space. It is, in fact, a, the ethics of social life. And therefore, as we're talking about a co-constitution of the state and the and the society, from the perspective of the people,、uh, the 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 tianxia、uh, is a lot larger than the state and the society. 呃，由于这个问题讲起来太费时间，大家都很疲倦了，所以我只是提示到这里。呃，我相信以后还会有机会再继续讨论这个问题。呃，我只是想强调一点，就是我们对于中国这样的一个国家的想象，也许还不够充分，不够完整。Um, I know everybody's tired, so I wouldn't be able to to fully unpack this point.、Um, but I think it's sufficient to、uh, to leave it as it is.、Um, I just wanted to say, based on this particular obs observation, that perhaps our imagination of Chinese as a mo modern nation state is still unfinished and perhaps、uh, in incomplete. Thank you, three translators, for this two days' hard work. For us, it means. 呃，你们的工作让我们意识到了彼此之间都有很多不能进入英语的剩余的部分。呃，我们会带走这些剩余的部分，让它在我们今后的知识生活里边继续发酵，继续成长。谢谢大家。Um, in closing, I want to especially thank the three translators because your your labor and hard work has made us aware of the surpluses of our culture that cannot be、uh, cannot be fully translated or adequately translated into English, and we'll carry on with these surpluses and work them out in our intellectual life onwards. Thank you very much. Yes, thank you, you three. Well,、uh, it's been a long two days, and I don't think I have anything to add.、Uh, Professor Sunge has laid out in fairly detailed、uh, manner the number of concerns that have emerged over the last two days, questions where serious communication or conversation amongst us has, I think, taken some, begun at least. Uh, taken a few steps, and there are obviously areas where、uh, divergent histories, divergent experiences. I can see, for example, on the question of nationalism, there is、uh, perhaps a still a somewhat different. I mean, I think the fact that Indian nationalism is now practically、uh, come apart. And、uh, the idea of、uh, of thinking beyond the nation is now very much on the agenda. But apart from that, I think a whole lot of things have already been laid on the table, and we've spoken a lot. I think now we need to just meditate spiritually. <laughs> so I will just say thanks a lot to Indonesia School and、uh, Kochi Muziris Bianal. Thanks a lot to. Everybody who's made it,、uh, put all their work in making it a success, and、uh, I hope that some of the conversations that we have started today,、uh, we may be able to carry them on in some other ways、uh, in the coming days. Thank you. Thank you. Uh. 
我想说的事情是，呃，这是很长的两天，所以我其实也没有什么更多的要说了。刚刚孙哥老师也已经很详细的呃，把我们呃呃许多共同的关怀跟这整个我们的彼此之间的沟通所发生的事情，就出了一些。呃，有一些很详尽的阐释，然后我们也看到这这两天之间，我们在这个我们共同的关怀跟彼此的沟通上面也往前了几步。那当然，呃呃，这个历史跟我们的经验上面都有呃的都有很不同的、非常不同的的历史经验跟呃跟呃非常不同的历史经验。像譬如说在呃就是在这个呃民族主义的问题上面。呃呃，像在像在这里，他基本上就是他的这个呃，他被呃，他已经是基本上在一层上一在我们的一层上面是就是已经是被拆解的一个东西。那呃，我希望呃呃呃，谢谢呃每个来参与的人，让呃共同努力，让我们这次的讨论。可以呃，可以，可以有这样的一个讨论，呃，然后我希望我们的这些对话可以在呃，跟这些共同的关怀跟问题，可以再继续的、呃、继续的发酵，可以继续的在其他地方，可以让这样的讨论在除了这个地方之后继续下去。啊，谢谢大家。